Good morning, everybody. Beautiful day out here on the ranch. Hope everybody's having a great day. It's nine o'clock. Day's been started long already. But today I want to talk about being simple-minded. I was going to talk about other things, but it bothers me. It really bothers me how simple people are, you know? It does not make sense to me, you know? I'm here pouring my heart out every fucking day, you know, doing shit that most people will never fucking do, which is tell other people how they feel, you know, especially men. Big man, big man, they don't tell everybody how they feel, because they're big man. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. But I want to say today that, you know, you should stop being fucking simple. You know? I make a video of me jumping in the pool telling people to join my business. 184 views. I make a fucking video of me flipping off my tractor into the pool. 200, 400 views, you know? Don't make any fucking sense. Yeah, I know I'm a fun guy, you know? But this shit I'm talking about here every fucking day, it's much more important than that bullshit, you know? It's not more important than, it's equally as important as joining my business. Which if you're participating here, anywhere in North America, you fucking goddamn should, you know? I mean, you're stupid not to. You know, right now, hey, morning, brother. Right now, my business is only 39 bucks to join, so, and 25 a month to run your company off of fucking multi-million dollar software that they developed. <laughs> you can't fucking do that shit for yourself, unless you're a fucking millionaire already. And even then, why would you want to waste money on something you can get for 39 bucks? Doesn't make sense. But again, people are simple-minded as fuck. You know? And I don't understand that. You know, why the fuck do people not think bigger? I don't understand. You know? Ah, my wife's texting me here. <clears throat> but you gotta think fucking bigger. You know, you gotta fucking think outside of your goddamn box. Stop being so fucking simple, you know? Zach Mayo here, he ain't simple-minded. He owns his own businesses. He makes good damn money. He's kicking life's ass, and I like that. And hopefully later today I'll see you. But you gotta surround yourself with people like that. You gotta surround yourself with people that are fucking kicking life's ass. Not people that are laying on the fucking couch. Not people that are laying down and dying, you know? Not people that are on their fucking knees every day, listening to all the brainwashing of the fucking world. You don't want to be around those people. You want to be the one doing the fucking brainwashing, you know? And I don't believe that this is brainwashing, but like I said, every listening to me every day will fucking change your mind. Because I listen to people like me every fucking day and it changed my mind. You know? But never in my motherfucking life have I been a fucking simple person. You know? Growing up my whole life. Like I said, when I was a kid. You know, I was selling shit when I was a kid. <laughs> you know? I had a book filled with magazine clippings of shit that I wanted when I was fucking four years old. You know? And now, my vision, like I said, it's so big, I want the world and everything in it. You know? I don't want to die like Tony Montana did. But his mind wasn't right, you know? He was a drug addict. Never get high on your own supply. Didn't, he must have not read the fucking Ten Crack Commandments. I guess. But, my vision is so large that I don't think it fits in this planet, you know? 
So maybe we gotta go find one that it does fit in, wherever that may be. But I ain't never gonna be simple, you know? I'm telling you right now that personal growth, if you get on a personal growth mindset and off of a fucking flip your fucking simple switch off, you're gonna have such a better life that, you know, I can't even tell you how awesome it's gonna be for you because it's awesome for me and my family, you know? And my dad fucking, you know, he fucking did it. Now I'm fucking doing it. You know, he helped me greatly with my mentality my whole life. And you know what? He did a lot of fucked up shit on his way to being where he is. You know, and I did a lot of fucked up shit on my way to me being here. But neither one of us have ever been fucking simple. You know, this right here on me. It's very fucking complicated. It's insanity. I was hospitalized for it, already over it, you know? People get put in jail for it. Whatever, you know? Those are fucking people that have, you know, that think outside of the fucking nor of normality, if that's even a word. If it isn't, it is now. But you can't fucking be simple. You know, what are you simply going to fucking do today? You're going to simply go to your fucking job, simply do what you're fucking told, simply say, yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. I'll do that for you, sir. You simply going to fucking exist like that for the rest of your fucking life. You telling me that's what people are telling me when 184 people Watch a simple video of me saying to join my business and not one of them fucking goddamn gives me a phone call. I don't understand that. Oh, you like the things that I do. That's good. <laughs> I cracked myself up. You gotta, you gotta fucking laugh at yourself. But... One of these days I'll do a fucking thing on my life story. I could take a long ass fucking time though. I would take probably an hour. Unless I simplify it. Which I don't like to do. I don't like to simplify shit. Because I'm not a simple person. Never gonna be. But today, do something that isn't fucking simple. You know, if you did simple shit all week, if you liked simple posts on Facebook, if you made simple fucking money this week, go fucking do something outside of your comfort zone. Go fucking do something different today, you know? <clears throat> I, just don't, I just don't get it. You know, I guess it took me, it took me a lot of hard work to get here, you know? Mentally and physically, you know, it's taken me everything I have to get right here with my feet on this ground out of my own fucking personal hell that I created. But it took me a long time to get into that hell, too. It took me years of fucking myself up to get into that fucking crater that I fucking dug, you know. And at one point, I stopped digging it with a shovel. And I was using an excavator. Then when the excavator broke, I fucking, you know, I got in some mining equipment. and went down even further. You know, it started to get exciting. Each level of your own personal hell is also an exciting, you know. <laughs> if you don't experience that for yourself, you, don't, you will never know how good it feels to actually be doing good in your life, you know. If you're just a normal fucking person... You know, that, that's simple and never has anything happen to them wrong in their life and never experience any pain. You're not gonna, you're not gonna even know what joy is. So, you know, I don't recommend becoming a fucking meth addict or anything or an alcoholic. I don't recommend becoming addicted to anything that's bad for you. You should want to fucking get addicted to things that are all good, but, you know, 
If you never experienced any pain in this life, you'll never know what it's like to fucking feel good. You know? Because it'll all be the same. And I don't think that that's possible, honestly. You know, it doesn't matter how much money you fucking have or don't or how much love you have or don't. You know, you're still, at the end of the day, you're still going to experience pain. So, you know, it's unavoidable. But how you deal with that pain, you know, that's what separates the men from the boys and the women from the girls. Or the... <laughs> or the unicorns from the... Whatever the fuck there is now today. You know? Whatever gender you define yourself as. Oh no, there's only two, sorry. <laughs> oh yeah. But today, stop being fucking simple today. Do something unbelievable today. Kick this day's fucking ass today. And let's go! Have an awesome day.